Well, not all jobs are for everyone, but for the right person, the right job isn't work at all. Andy Barth introduces us to an Oklahoman who's made a bare bones career choice. From the outside, it's a typical museum. But once inside, a preserved animal kingdom awaits. From the dangerous T-Rex to the family of apes. This museum shows all creatures, small and large. I have a museum of bones because I started collecting bones and skulls whenever I was a little boy. Jay Villamoretti is the founder and owner of the Museum of Osteology, a museum home to more than 300 skeletons. I took my hobby and started selling skulls. As my collection grew, so did my business, and eventually my collection grew to the point that I wanted to do something with it more than just hoarded it at the house. I wanted to share it with the world. And Villa Moretti says putting together a skeleton is a lot harder than you would think. An enormous amount of work goes into assembling a skeleton. When the public walks by a skeleton, I'll watch them, and they'll just meander past the skeleton, not realizing what went into that. The process for cleaning a skeleton is extensive. The museum receives an animal carcass and begins cutting as much meat off as possible. Then the specimen moves to the bug room, where thousands of beetles strip the remaining flesh to the bone. Once the beetles are through feasting, the crew whitens and degreases the bones before assembling the skeleton. And the bigger the skeleton, the longer it takes. Our humpback whale, once we took possession of it, it took us approximately two years just to clean the skeleton. Once we started to assemble the bones, it was 28 days to put the skeleton together. That was with full, two full-time technicians plus the assistance of three others. And Villa Moretti says he wants to educate those who visit the museum. It's a real good feeling when I have a grandmother will come up to me and thank me for doing this and especially thank me for having it in Oklahoma City because she had no idea how wonderful this museum could be. So if you're ever in Oklahoma City and looking for something to do, head to Villa Moretti's place where the displays are just dying to see you. Open seven days a week, the Museum of Osteology is the only all-skeleton museum in the entire world. And we do have a link to their website under this week's stories.